news that's coming in at the moment. The CBI has now filed a report with regards to the NEET UG and this report has been filed before the Supreme Court in a sealed cover. This is an India Today exclusive that we are getting you. This is the CBI that has filed the reply to Supreme Court with regards to the NEET UG examination. CBI report highlights that there was indeed a paper leak that took place. CBI report also highlights that the paper leak took place only in a small area. The paper leak was confined to the local region. Paper leak only from one Bihar centre. The CBI, like in all likelihood, will also mention that the leak was limited to just a few students. There were only a handful of students who had got their hands on the paper examination paper. My colleague Shrishti is now joining me on the story. Shrishti, this is a big exclusive that India Today has broken. In the sealed cover, we will see that the CBI will submit the report in front of the Supreme Court. And from what we are understanding, Shrishti, at the moment, there indeed was a case of paper leak. Uh, well, yes, Ashwara, as you pointed out, it was an India Today exclusive where we broke this information last night that CBI is likely to file its report in a steel cover before Supreme Court today. Now we are uh, hearing that the report has already been filed before the top court uh, ahead of the hearing that's supposed to happen on the NEET, EG, uh, NEET UG issue. As far as our, uh, what our sources have told us with regard to what CBI has said in that particular report is that CBI has told Supreme Court that there was in fact a paper leak but it was localized, it was limited to a local area, it happened from one particular centre and therefore, the paper leak was limited to very few students, uh, considering it was confined to a local area and only to say here is that the impact of that paper leak was only localized and the impact was not as huge as uh, is uh, being claimed. Also, uh, CBI has also countered the allegations with regard to the leak, paper leakage and circulation of the leaked uh, NEET UG paper on social media. Remember, there were arguments regarding this before the Supreme Court as well. Now, CBI has told the uh, Supreme Court in its report uh, that no social media was also involved in paper leakage. No such circulation of leaked paper happened on social media. So, CBI likely to tell court that uh, yes, paper leak did happen, but it was looked Localized, happened from one particular center and was only confined to a few students. Uh, we have a very crucial hearing coming up today before Supreme Court because the court had directed affidavits to be filed by right. center, NTA and a status report to be filed by CBI. It will be important to see what the top court decides after going through uh, the affidavits that uh, the center, NTA and CBI have filed before the top court. Back to you. Right, thank you Shrishti for giving us all those details. The CBI all set to submit its report on NEET UG in front of the Supreme Court today. Now all eyes will be on the Supreme Court because the Supreme Court is all set to give its verdict with regards to the NEET UG examination. There's a big controversy regarding the examination. The Supreme Court in fact has filed an effort, the centre in fact has now filed an affidavit regarding the NEET PG controversy in the Supreme Court. Now, this report, which has been filed by the center, it includes data analyst, uh, data coming in from IIT Madras. It reveals that there were crucial insights into the NEET UG 2024 examination. According to the analysis, there was no mass malpractice in the examination. Candidates did not achieve abnormal scores. The mark distribution was reported to be completely normal and there was a general increase in students uh, that was increased in students across the centers. There has been a 25% reduction in the syllabus and that has been identified as a contributing factor to the overall increase in marks that came to the fore. Sources have told India today, the CBI has also confirmed there was no mass leak with regards to the NEET UG examination. The paper leak was confined to a very local area, specifically to one particular center in the state of Bihar. Only a very few students had access to the leaked paper and importantly, there was no involvement of social media in the paper leak.